Well, it's official. Uh, my favorite TV show is now officially ended with the departure of this gentleman here. Hey, Al, Steve Bantha here. I just wanted to call and uh, uh, bid farewell. I'm heading down to Phoenix, uh, as you know. Uh, I've enjoyed my time here, as you also know, and I've enjoyed dealing with you. Uh, I think that uh, at times we, we don't agree, uh, but both of us are looking to improve, improve public transit here in the uh, TriMet region, and we both know uh, who runs the service, and that's the operators behind the wheel. Uh, take care, good luck, and uh, I will be looking in on your blog from time to time. Take care. Bye. Well, that's the official. I appreciate that he actually did, took the time to call and say that. I'm a little bit surprised that he would even be thinking of me at all, if you want to know the truth. Uh, but that's a very appropriate ending because all of my, all of this blogging stuff really took off when he was here. and. Uh, and that's kind of like the official. And he's gone, and you know, I, I you know, I, I don't, I didn't work with him directly, but I liked him as a person. You know, the few times I had contact with him, I liked the guy. I just liked him. We did have contact with him. It was a positive experience. And even when he was telling, saying no to me, it was a positive experience. So take it as it is. I don't like the fact that. He, him and Peggy had it out, but I don't know anything about that either, so I'm just making a, a judgment about it without knowing the facts. I don't know what he was seeing at his level. But yeah, I'm going to miss Steve Banta, you know. Uh, I really will, and I hope he does well in Phoenix. I'm sure he'll be happy to be in charge, you know. This is his first uh, directorship, and I, I investigated him back when he was in Allegheny Transit. Is when I started following Steve Banta and before he got here. And uh, so now he's finally going to be in charge of his own place, and that should be interesting because he wants to be doing what, everybody, what the directors of where he's at are telling him to do. I'm sure that he scrupulously followed his instructions of Fred and the other guy over there in Allegheny. And uh, I might just start following Phoenix Transit just to see how it is down there, you know. Uh, there's worse places to be than Phoenix, you know, it's a pretty nice area. A little bit redneck for my taste, but it's got a great environment, you know. I would love to see the sun once in a while around here in the wintertime. It gets so depressing here. Anyway, good luck, Steve Banner. And I can't wait to see who comes in on a permanent basis to fill your position up. I don't know why they don't just keep Shelly. Uh, what's wrong with her? I, I know Shelly. And she obviously knows what she's doing, and she's been here at TriMet. She was a good station manager, I know that much, and I know a lot of people that I've talked to about Shelly. Everybody says positive things about her, you know. And we don't always get what we want from our managers. We get told no, or you do this differently, whatever, but it's how you're told no, how, the, how they handle us that makes it a good place to work. And, when I was working with Shelly, I never had a problem with her, no, or the way she would explain to me why we had to do things this way or that way. And so I think she'd probably be a good executive director. So why don't they just hire her permanently? Why bother with the whole search? Bye, Steve. Have fun.